Hello guys, welcome back to Lamb's Kitchen where we prepare easy and healthy meals. Today we are going to prepare your kegari, aka gobe, aka cocoa and beans, aka mansoon comb. Mansoon comb is a term coined by some beans buyers of my grandma when I was a kid. I'm going to tell you all about it. So let's go on and start with the cooking. Alright guys, so first off, I'm going to wash my beans and soak it in more water for about 10 to 15 minutes before I cook it. Okay, so after my beans is soaked for about 10 to 15 minutes, I'm going to transfer it into the pot in which I'm going to cook it. After transferring the beans into my cooking pot, I'm going to add about 2 cups of water. Then I will put it on the stove and allow it to cook over medium heat. Alright guys, so I'm going to allow this beans to take its sweet time to be ready. This particular beans takes a while to be ready so I'm not going to put any pressure on it. I'll allow it to boil over medium heat. Time to time, check if your beans needs more water then you add a cup or two to it. This will allow it to cook well, it will allow it to become soft. Some people add potassium nitrate or canway to it so that the beans will become soft fast but it can cause your tummy to ache so please avoid adding potassium nitrate to your beans. Okay so I'm going to add salt to my beans now that it's ready. Alright so now that our beans is ready I'm going to heat my palm oil. I'm using Zomi because for beans if you use any other palm oil you wouldn't enjoy it zomi brings out the best taste in beans all right next is to fry our plantain are you ready for our story 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 <laughs> guys so when i was in the primary school my grandma used to sell beans she used to sell the best beans in the community uh -huh. What do you want? You don't want me to tell my story. Okay, so your great grandma, she used to sell beans. She used to sell beans to some students in our community. And anytime they they came to buy beans, they would tell her mansoon come, mansoon come. Daddy mansoon come. And all they were trying to say is that add more water to the beans. So that when she adds the gari, the gari will rise in the beans and they will eat to their satisfaction. People, our gari and beans is ready. You can see our plantain representing our gari and our green sauce also representing over there. Charlie, this beans there, Ah, I can't wait to enjoy it. Oh my god. <laughs> Mm, yummy all right so personally i like my gari and beans without pepper some people like to eat with pepper just do you anything goes all right guys try this for your family and friends and thank me later Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye.